single action revolvers are a whole lot of fun, especially in 22. And what I'm working with today is the Ruger Wrangler. And this is a pretty cool one, it has kind of a, a gray Cerakote on it, but I wanted to talk about the basics of loading, unloading, and running a single action revolver if you're not familiar with it. So I just shot the gun dry, shot all six shots. So let's talk about unloading the gun. Obviously on a single action, the cylinder does not swing out so you have to do it a different thing. This is the loading gate. So you pop the loading gate open, and then you always want to make gravity help you out, work with you. So you're gonna tip it up to help the shells fall out. And then this little rod will kick the shells out. And so you kind of want to have the gun in your left hand and you run everything with your right hand. Um, even if you're left-handed, this is probably the best way to do it. And I, and I open any suggestions in the comments if you guys have a, a different way or a better way to do it. But this is how I do it and how I was taught. So you just kind of work your way through and this hand is turning the cylinder while this hand kicks out the shells. You go all the way through and you can look and see, okay, yes, everything's out, it's unloaded. All right, so what about loading? Same idea, right? So have the gun in this hand and have your your ammo in the other hand. This will turn the cylinder and this loads. So you just put them in, turn it, obviously keeping the gun pointed in a safe direction and all that stuff. And work your way through all, all the holes, get this thing fully loaded. All right, all loaded up, you can check it. Then close the loading gate. Now, as far as running a single action, obviously the gun has to be cocked to shoot. So you can't just pull the trigger. So we're gonna shoot a couple shots and we'll talk about this. So running the gun, cock the hammer back. Now what happens if you have the hammer cocked and then you don't wanna shoot the gun? Well, the way I've been taught about this is doing it where you I'm gonna have this pointed in to the berm right now. Some people will put thumb on hammer, finger on trigger, and then just let it come down. The problem with that is if your thumb was to slip and the hammer falls, the gun can go off. So this is what I've been taught, is hammer's back. What you wanna do is you wanna put your thumb in front of the hammer so it cannot fire the gun. Now. You let it down, and then you can kind of very slowly and carefully let the hammer down that way. Obviously, keeping the gun pointed in a safe direction at all times. Um, so those are just a few tips on running a single action revolver. Uh, it's pretty fun, it's pretty easy, but loading it, unloading it, if you do it the right way, it'll be easy, it'll be a little bit faster, and you'll get some more shooting in. <laughs>